I just shit my pants. Hello and welcome back to the grand finale of this episode. There is no maybe, there is no possibly, there is no extra chapter after this. This is the finale and I am your Middle Eastern geek and nerd and I am about to beat the hell out of this game. Although I'm kind of out of Type 61 film. Although I do have some Type 0. Counting on that. Fingers crossed. <laughs> She said she's something. Something over here. Examine. Okay. Oh, I think that... Oh my god. I think... Oh no, I got it. Yeah! yeah. Oh, that is awesome. Although I am one crystal off of getting the other one, but that's fine. It's okay. I am more than satisfied, although... Am I missing a doll? Fuka, the Tsukimori song. Mommy, I'm not doing this. My mother left some documents she wrote here about the Tsukimori song. On Rogetsu Island, there is a family known as Tsukimori. The Tsukimori family guards the lunar melody as the protectors of the moon. On the Rogetsu Island, there are many legends about the lunar melody and about its people's destiny. One quick second. You are recording and you are recording. Good, okay. The Tsukimori family also guards the Tsukimori song. In the Tsukimori song, the day of the new moon becomes a melody. The me melody converts the young just like the mother's womb. <gasps> At times, when the moon is troubled, it will resonate, culminating in the blooming. When the moon is troubled, the Tsukimori family soothes the raging moon and the lost souls through the Tsukimori song. Once the song reaches those souls, they may return to the spirit world through the moon. Okay. So doing the song basically undoes this entire thing. There's no doll on there? I didn't hear any jingling, but when I came across the last doll, there was no jingling either. Which kind of scares me. Makes me wonder why. Okay, no doll as of yet. Let's climb on up. Oh no, the lady in black, you guys. Test? Okay, I do do damage. Oh no! Oh no, 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 no. Oh no, that asshole. Oh no. I do need to recharge my thing so that's what I'm going to be doing first just basically recharging nicely done 
Yes, yes. Okay. Oh. <sighs> Do a shit ton of damage. Ah. Oh. I don't care. I don't even need no critical strikes. I can do a lot of damage on my own, girl. Now let me move. Quiet. Two. be able to hear you all the better. <laughs> one more time. <laughs> Just one more time after this. Oh, let me find the last time. Oh, please, let me find it. Now, it's because I've yet to find the very last doll that I did not use my Type 0 film. And so I assume there's at least one more battle after this. Okay, so I guess... Yeah, it's referring to whatever is up there. Okay. Right? Oh, please. I'm sorry. I, I I need to check. I've 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 come too far. I've come way too far. I will be right back.
Let's go kill her again. This time, I'm using Pips here. Because apparently she is the last boss. As easy as she was. Come on, bring it on. Bring it on. I thirst for your blood. After I'm through with you, they will call you the lady in red. Triple hit combo! And then, last but not least, I shall take you with my final Type Zero film to bring it all to a final epic close. You see what that says over there? Look at it. Look at it. Complete. It is complete. The Tsukimori song. I know. I know. I like my mom. If the moon is troubled, the lunar song soothes the raging moon and the dead souls. If the song reaches the soul, it may return to the afterlife. Do I have to play it or is she just gonna play it for me? Please just just play it for me. Don't don't put me don't put me through this. The score seems like a song like this must be. Yeah, sure. <laughs> Great, there's more to it now. Okay, I got this. Damn it, it was just that one part. Let me redo it. What? Who? Oh! Seriously? I don't even know what was happening. There you go.
Okay. I'll pay better attention this time. God. This was harder than the final boss. So through her, all the souls get to transfer over, but my question is, you know, what about Madoka? What about Misaki? You will always remain in my heart, handsome detective. Daddy, I can see your face now, Daddy. Epic J pop right there, man. Daddy, Daddy, Oh, Oh, Those the dolls. Those the dolls. I 
I'd like to know if I got a different ending for getting all the dolls. No, wait, no, that's my dad working on the mask, isn't it? I love this game. I loved it. Only parts I didn't really enjoy as much would be the parts with the detective. He just felt a little wonky. Um, his story, I think his story does fit in this and I feel like, you know, without that, a lot of it wouldn't make sense. However, there are still a lot of pieces that don't fit that has me questioning, but this, as I mentioned in the very first episode or second, one of the first episodes, this is the kind of game where if you don't look around, if you don't pick up all the clues, you will end the game being confused as hell. So the fact that I have this many questions might mean that I missed out on a lot of the details the game explains to you. Because I obviously didn't always check every single room whenever I played with a different character. I sometimes did, mostly when I was playing as Ruka. But I'm pretty sure there's still a lot that I missed out on. I just want to know why the ceremony failed. That is my big question. And this game sometimes has different endings according to the way you played the game. I wonder if... I can't remember when I first started the game if I started it on normal because only normal was provided to me. Or I started it on normal because I didn't want to do a higher <laughs> Super Mario Club. Yeah. <laughs> you don't exist anymore. Um, I want to know if I chose normal because that was the only thing provided or because I was recording. I feel like I should have chosen a harder difficulty. Just because I'm the kind that likes a harder difficulty and this is the kind of game that rewards you with a different ending if you choose a different difficulty. I know that the previous games were like that. I don't know if this one is. Anyways, I love this game. I would give this game... I need a good way to to rate games. I might. I usually give things by point fives, so it's either eight, eight point five, or nine. I don't do like eight point eight and stuff like that. But I think I would give this game an eight point five. Cause it was extremely enjoyable. And it's the kind of game that has you collecting the clues yourself. It, it does not walk you through. It's difficulty spikes. It's not repetitive. Like, at the very end, you know, I, that, I got like sick and tired of the ghosts. But then it just like stopped throwing ghosts at you. It was like, okay, yeah. We get it. You can go through this. And so the game paces itself excellently. D! Go screw yourselves. 159 out of 233. Wow. Mission mode has been on. Yeah, hard mode now is unlocked so I couldn't choose a diff uh, harder mode. power up stop power up lens explode don't care power up lens crush extended sense Ruka costume 2 Ruka costume 3 Choshiro costume 2 Misaki costume 2 Misaki costume 3 6 Ruka class uh, glasses 3 wow it's just a whole bunch of cosmetics that it unlocks for you which I mean 
I, I kind of actually enjoyed the game for its uh, outfits. Again, I like Buttercups the most. And that seems to be the uh, end of that. And you got a new title screen as well. So yeah, I'd give this game an 8.5. It's not perfect, but it's fun as hell. It's extremely fun. I would recommend this. I would recommend this to anybody that's into horror games. Um, you know, it's not, oh my God, amazing, but not too many flaws. No, it was, it's mainly just with the detective. Otherwise, it was extremely fun, and I loved it. I just wish that hard mode is unlocked for you from the beginning. Forcing you to have to play through the entire game in order to play a harder mode is something that I do not like about games. Don't force me to play your game all the way through before unlocking a hard mode, especially since after hard mode, there is nightmare mode. So. Let me play through hard, mo hard mode and then let me unlock nightmare mode. Don't make me play the game three times. That shit sucks. <laughs> Anyways. I loved it. I had a lot of fun. And until the next time we meet. This is your Middle Eastern geek and nerd. Peacing out. <laughs>